Hi guys, my name is Dixon and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will be showing you how to buy coins on decentralized finance, which is DeFi. Now, the most used decentralized finance is PancakeSwap, which is actually owned by Binance. Now, to trade on PancakeSwap, first you have to open your trust wallet and then you have to send Binance Smart Chain coin into your trust wallet. Now, take note, Binance, Binance coin are two types bnb coin are two types one is binance smart chain this is the one you use to trade decentralized finance and the second is bnb they are the same thing if you as you can see they are on the same price they are the same thing but one is used to trade um decentralized finance on pancake swap why this one is not used to trade decentralized finance on pancake swap so you have to move bnb to your trust wallet to do so you open your smart chain then click on receive, copy your address, then go to wherever your BNB is. My BNB is here. So my BNB is here. Then I come here, I click on BNB. Then I click on withdraw. I paste the address. Once you paste the address, it will bring out Binance Smart Chain by 20 automatically. Uh, they, then you put the amount of BNB you want to withdraw. Then you click on withdraw. So when you withdraw Binance Smart Chain BNB, it, you receive it directly on your trust wallet here to come to Binance Smart Chain. Then when you get it on Binance Smart Chain, you go to DApps. On DApps, you go to Pancake Swap. This is Uniswap. This Uniswap is used to trade decentralized finance on on uh, Ethereum network. But Pancake Swap is used to trade decentralized finance on Binance network. So click on Pancake Swap. Once it opens, you connect your wallet. So we are using Trust. I'm using Trust Wallet. So I click on Trust Wallet. It connects automatically. Now it has loaded my Binance Smart Chain. So which coin do I want to swap? Let's take for instance, any coin you want to swap, make sure you are getting the coin address from either CoinMarketCap or CoinGecko. That is where you get the original address or sometimes the coin website. So now that we are on CoinMarketCap, Let's take for instance, I want to swap Floki Inno. So I find Floki. Floki Inno. This is Floki Inno. And then scroll down to where the contract address is. This is the contract address of Floki Inno. Then I copy the contract address. Copy. Address copied. Then I take the address to Pancake Swap. Click on Select Currency. Paste the address, paste. It loads Floki automatically. It's showing 5,000 because I have 5,000 Floki in coin. So since I'm using it for example, then I want to swap BNB to Floki. So I click zero. Uh, I want to swap um, 0 0.0, 0, 0, 0 1 BNB for Floki. Yeah, then swap, swap, error. Here I will remove the numbers, delete the numbers after decimal and also the decimal. Then swap, accept, price change, confirm swap. Proof for la and submissions match chain BNB balance. Saying I don't have enough balance to swap this coin. So what that means is that I should always have BNB to swap the coin. So to swap any coin at all. So here I reduce my buying price again to make sure I can buy swipe. Confirm swap. 
decimal problem delete decimals swap confirm swap still insufficient balance so it's still saying the same thing um, I'm just trying to make sure that I swap a coin successfully 0.0001 this should go remove decimals swap confirm swap yes approve yeah so after a successful swap you can view on bsc scan to confirm that you have received your token to see the transaction details of the token you swapped so that is that on how to swap on pancake swap so you can come to wallets view flokino you can see the 300 the 300 plus token i swapped has added so yeah that is that on how to swap on pancake swap with trust wallet thank you guys for watching if you love to make money in crypto kindly subscribe to my channel and i will be doing another video on um, how to swap on solana network thank you once again